the home dito sa lineup na may Ruby. Kasi kung gusto mo nga namang pumigil at magpabagal ng mga tao, manghila ng tao, ba Ruby na ang gawagawa nun para sa'yo. This is going to be a very interesting match. You see Aura PH just pulling out something from the hat na tinatawag ka natin. Mm-hmm. But you know what? Execution. On the other hand, <laughs> sila yung, uh, sabi na natin sila yung may simple na lineup dito. They do. They do have a bit more easier to execute It's lineup. It's easier Tama? to execute oh. lineup. So, if ever they want to win this, kailangan lang talaga nila sundan yung pattern na required para sa kanila. Yeah. But for Aura PH, it takes a bit of a bit more effort. But if they can pull it off, the, ito yung mga instances na parang mapapakamot ka na parang, paano? Paano to? Paano to? <laughs> The surprise factor is the the power here for Aura PH, right? Diba? Because mm. people don't expect the veil lineup until you see the veil lineup. So uh, I would I would think na mas tamang siya nabi mo kanina mas madaling ipull off yung lineup ngayon ng execution. Because sobrang sa nena sila dito, eh. especially with the Lunox. Ilang season na nilang gamit to, it's an easy way to get kills, easy mm. way to break burn damage in the early game. And uh, the problem with the veil is. It's later game damage, di ba? Mm. And some, may mga veil builds nga na hindi pang bawas talaga. More of pang crowd control. Yes. Which will allow yung kanilang hyper carry na maging, na to go for lower HP targets. Yun, yun yung punto eh, actually. Pag may veil ultimate, lo, hindi mo kailangan patayin using the veil ultimate. Mm. Kailangan mo lang siyang pababain ng buhay para mag-finish off siya nung hyper carry mo. In this case, that's the Lancelot. Mm. So will that work the way that Aura planned it? That is something that we have to notice in a bit. Pero nakita mo dito, that is the hot point, the key point mm-hmm. for Aura PH dito. Na nandiyan si Rafflesia, I can catch anyone out na tatambay dito sa may gilid. Pero kung papansin mo talaga dito, palong-palo si Rafflesia. Palong-palo? And look at the damage. Grabe yung damage output nila dito. Yep, it's real. And again, yung passive talaga nitong si ano eh, ni Hilda. It's just something that you, it's very difficult to deal with in the early stages of the game. It's a reason why this hero gets banned out all the time. Four people from Aura PH nakatambay ngayon sa mid lane. Control over Lito Wonder goes over to Execration still on okay. that left side. And we are back on even. Proactive dito si Hayden. Ang ginawa niya yung nakita niyang uh, binabasag na yung Lito Wonder dun sa may kabila. What he did was he went straight onto the other side. Pero si Benny Cutie dito hmm. has something in mind. He went there and nakalohod siya dito. And um, uh, It's a it's a way to delay JP. That's right. Good way to delay JP as well as also just you know have vision over that map. At haba din delay nila si JP. Si sa gitno kinukuha naman yung buff doon. I like yung pagmando dito ng mapa ng uh, execution mm-hmm. na kinukulit, Control, no? kinukulit nila si JP to the point na hindi niya makukuha muna yung kanyang uh, purple buff pero ibibigay din naman talaga nila while actually denying yung orange buff doon sa kanyang orange buff side. That's right. And that's a big deal. Uh, tanggalin mo ng orange JP, it's gonna be harder for him to slow down targets. Pero ang problema, of course, we will still be able to get some kills on the map. Ang problema, si Hate din, ang lakas din ng farm ngayon. Mm-hmm. On that cloud. Kumbaga, a uh, team, ito yung mga nakikita natin din sa mga carries natin. They're making adjustments. Pero palong-palo talaga <laughs> ang isang kill na dito. And uh, once na nandiyan yung Lunox at nag-scale up na yung Lunox, at the time, that's the time na magkakaroon ng onting problema na dito si Rafflesia. But right now, ayaw talaga muna nila ibigay yung level 4 noon as they will commit an ultimate galing kay Kilowash. And si Ito Max going down is a bad sign actually for Execration. I feel like dapat laging buhay si Ito Max to control the mid lane. And, or else it's gonna be an easy push here for Aura, I think. Especially Rafflesia right now, sobrang confident dito sa Hilda na to. Tsaka kasi 3 stacks na to eh. Yun nga eh. Ang bilis oh. actually. Nagulat ako. 3 stacks na to. So, 1 kill and 2 assist. Kailangan nila mag-ingat dito na kapag ka nakuha ni Rafflesia yung level 4 niya, that's going to be a significant boost in terms of damage. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. And now it's going to be, uh, again, clear lang ang magagawa ngayon ng XA. While the turtle is gonna go up, na tatargetin right away for sure ng Aura PH. And that's the power of a Hilda. Pero ito ah, Rockheart, ang importante yung point ng mapa ngayon is the turtle lane. Nandoon na yung turtle, nag setup na yung mga teams natin dito and you can see Lance, hindi siya masyadong naaalis dito. 
sa may purple buff area nila. Roughly siya daw, andito pa rin siya, hindi talaga siya ma-prepare ni Chuck no, umalis dito. Mm-hmm. sa place na to and uh, alam din ni alam din ni Rafael siya dito na in terms of the passives and yep. everything he's home he's siya at yung, home siya yung siya <laughs> yung nasa upper hand pagka nang ipang trade siya dito sa ginagawa ni Chuck no and look at this Grabe another yun. kill for Kilowash pero another stack na naman for Rafael siya din and the Benny Cutie raging sandstorm 2v1 lang naman JP pa- Phantom execution nagalawan Grabe naman Talaga, ang teamwork talaga nitong dalawang to. Mm-hmm. Hindi mo oh, talaga mapapatawad. Grabe yung blazing duet. Nagawa niya yung pakay ng blazing duet na yon. Clear. Na-clear niya yung wave. Exactly. Although, kamunti ka na nakita natin damage output na ginawa ni Greed dito. Greed gets caught out. Yung Ito Shita na. dito kay Rafflesia. Kilowash andito para umalalay. Pero ang sakit sa ulo talaga ng isang kill da. Agro kung agro, flicker out. Ito max. Pero doon sa baba, may Balmon tayo nagpo-push. And that's going to be the turtle going to the side of Rafflesia. Oh, parang dalawang bully nagsama eh, no? Si, ano, si Hilda, tsaka si, ano, mm. si Ruby. Na, hindi mo siya basta-basta mapapatay. Tapos hihila-hilain ka lang, hahampas-hampasin ka lang ng mga malalaking weapon na dala nila. So talagang talaga naman. And the problem is, for Aura PH, si Hate nakakalibre pa rin ng resources sa kabilang dako naman ng mapa. Talagang talaga naman. Talagang talaga naman. <laughs> Si Chuck na naman dito, nagkita na naman sa Kira Pisha. Bestie! Bestie! Bestie, kamusta ka? Mm. Pero Sakit. si Chuck, si Chuck no, at least, hindi niya binibigay yung brush na yan. Tama, tama. Ayaw niyang ibigay, he denies the fact na nakukuha na ng aura to. Kung gusto man ng aura ng control nun, kailangan nilang paghirapan. Oo. Oh. Diba? Pero alam mo, Aura PH, they're getting the game that they want. Ito nga Ay, eh. Ito yung game na talagang confident sila na kaya nilang mapanalo as long as yung pacing na to tumuloy-tuloy para sa side nila. Yup, and Greed making it work on the veil. Ha? Pansin oh. mo, ha, hindi, hindi siya, he's not getting the all the kills, pero somehow he's really helping in controlling the waves at yung controlling yung teamfight. Ayaw pumasok ng X eh, kasi yung damage output is real from the veil as well. Mm. Oh, nakikita mo na naman dito. Ito na naman yung... Uh, Invade factor na oh, pinapakita na dito ng side ng Aura PH. Although makukuha ni Hate yung buff niya doon. Walang maagaw sa kanya. Pero yung Hilda dito, namamakay na talaga. <laughs> no, this feels na. like home. Yes. This is my, this is my turf mamaya, now. Mamaya, I promise, makakatulog na yun dyan. Oo, oh, makita mo, nakahiga na. na. Hindi, naman, ganun naman talaga pag namamahay. May diba? kubo na. Oh. Ganun, no. oh, pero na, eto, sabi niya, sige, namahay ka. At look at the damage. Isang nakaplang ang katumbas. Sa kapli siya dito. Gusto siya na wawalang buhay. Siya pa gusto lumaban. Ang grabe yung Uy, knockout. Uy, counterplay. Uy! And look at this. The pull from Kilowash. Napaflaker out siya dito. Tignan natin kung papaano ang pacing netong sunod ng mga teamfight na mangyayari. Look at JP. Talaga pumasok oh, si JP, na siya dito. Sa phantom execution. Wala na siyang dash in dito. And that's going to be the punish. Great play from Benny Cutie, realizing na wala nang pangtakas at that point yep. si, si JP. Sobrang ganda ng ginawa ng execution doon, going for the for who we really need to go for. And a big mistake for JP to go chase heat into uncharted territory na wala silang vision. So, naging problem yon and hate was able to get an assist because of that as well. Napaka, it, it was just uncharacteristic for JP to go there without backup. And ang ganda naman ng sagot ng Exedon as well. And execration making things count. Hate dito has the turtle. And level 12 na si Hate. If you would look at the items ni Hate dito, I'm pretty sure na nakukuha niya na din yung perfect setup para sa kanya. And there is another pick of Hate dito. Man oh man, he's just mm-hmm. going ham. And grabe yung farm ni Hate dito. Sakit! Mga turtle pa yan. And another 2v1. Tower goes down as well. Sa bot lane, execration ngayon. Galit na galit. Going for the hunt. Eto na si Chaknu. That was a nice try. Kung nasipa sana yun sa kabilang direction, iba sana ang magiging resulta noon. Pero still, makukuha pa rin ng exe ang Torre sa gitna. At nagbago ang pacing ng story natin dito. Execration, they are leading this again. Kung nakikita nyo, lamang na naman sa kills yung Aura PH dito. Pero in terms of gold, iba ang story. Sila pa rin ang lumalamang. Sila pa rin ang lumalamang. And ito yung sinasabi natin, relentless, perseverance, persistent. Ayaw nilang ibigay ng madali yep. itong laban na to. Sabi nga nila na, ni Shinbo, puso. 
puso talaga. talaga Kung baga hindi nila susukuan, yun lang yung isang, uh, yun yung isang factor ng execration na makikita mo para sa side nila na talagang gumagana. Hindi nila sinusukuan, basta-basta. Pero grabe na mong pick yun! Chakno, boy! Sinasabi yan natin, Chakno. The X Factor. The X Factor. Out of nowhere. By the way, misposition from Greed to go near that bush. Pero I guess yun yung mahirap pag you don't have heroes like Yusan Shin, Selena, or Diggy for the map control, for the vision. Talagang there's no way but to face check those bushes. Pero kung nakikita mo naman dito, Rockheart, kung paano na siya may setup dito, yung side ng execration sa loob ng gubat ng Aura PH. And this could be bad for the side of execration, pero mababa din yung buhay dito ni JP. If they can get the kill, this would be bad for the side of Aura PH. Nandun sa may likod, kilowash dito, nahuli na siya. And execration is manning up to everyone here on the side of Aura PH. Bigla na lang nag-swing yung favor pabalik sa execration just because Hate is getting the farm that he needs. Finally, Hate is looking better here. Aside from that turtle buff na nakuha niya kanina, going for the Lord as well. Slow and steady on the objectives. That is the name of the game right now for execration with a 5,000 gold lead laban sa Aura PH dito sa game 2. But ito, Rockheart ha. May tinatawag tayo dito. One mistake could actually cost execration. Looking at the Gillette Instant Replay, look at this fight, Rockheart. It actually did look better kasi walang ibang sagot ang aura kundi ang tumakbo. Doon sa posisyon na ginagawa ng Exe around their jungle area. So, this is forcing Aura PH to go into weird situations and awkward positions na lumalamang sila sa laban dahil doon. And nahuli si, nahuli JP. si JP! Nahuli si JP and that is bad for the side of Aura. They might have dropped the ball dito sa game na to. But let's see, Grid, nahuli niya si Hate na tumatalon dito habang nagbi-blazing duet. And this is really the time where Execration wants to finish this. Wala si JP, wala si Grid. This is the perfect time for them. And look at them, para silang nag-aabang dito ng bus para ilabas sila. Dito sa base Take me out Aura PH Pero sabi nila dito Wala nang patumpik-tumpik Tapusin na natin to 4 seconds Habang mag-respond na si JP And this Is Going to be the crucial moment Of the fight Buhay na uli si JP There is damage output And look at this Chaos Darkening It's there Lethal counter na ba to Roughly siya dito Yung hilda niya kanina Na sobrang bully Ngayon siya na ang binubuli And man oh man Execration dito Just rallying Last back Last wave Getting this win against the side of Aura PH, ladies and gentlemen.